There are few machines in modern warfare that evoke as much awe and fear as the F-22 Raptor. To its allies, it is a guardian of the skies. To its enemies, it is a phantom, a whisper in the clouds that strikes before being seen. Developed by Lockheed Martin and first introduced into service in 2005, the F-22 is not merely an aircraft, it is a declaration of dominance. It represents the very pinnacle of American aerospace engineering, a jet so advanced that, even today, no other nation has managed to produce an equal. When it roars into the sky, it carries with it a reputation built not just on technology, but on the psychological terror it instills. Pilots from around the world train to fight aircraft like the Su-35, the Rafale, or even the F-15, but none train to face the Raptor. Because how do you prepare to fight something you can't even see? The F-22's reputation for invisibility and unmatched agility has made it one of the most feared fighter jets in history. But this legend wasn't built overnight. It was forged in decades of ambition, secrecy, and relentless pursuit of perfection. To understand why the Raptor stands alone, we must go back to its origins, a time when air dominance was not just a goal, but an obsession. The roots of the F-22 trace back to the Cold War, when the United States and the Soviet Union were locked in a relentless technological arms race. In the 1980s, U.S. defense planners realized that fourth-generation fighters, like the F-15 Eagle and F-16 Fighting Falcon, would eventually be outmatched by emerging Soviet designs. The solution was the Advanced Tactical Fighter, ATF, program, an ambitious project aimed at building a jet that could dominate any airspace on Earth. The requirements were almost impossible, the aircraft had to be invisible to radar, capable of supersonic flight without afterburners, and agile enough to outmaneuver anything in existence. Lockheed Martin's prototype, codenamed YF-22, defeated Northrop's YF-23 in a grueling competition that tested not just speed and maneuverability, but survivability. Every bolt, every surface, every curve of the F-22 was refined through years of classified research. The result was a machine that redefined the laws of aerial combat. The Raptor was built with a radar cross-section so small that, on radar screens, it appeared as nothing more than a bird. Yet, while the world marveled at its stealth, what truly set the F-22 apart was how seamlessly it combined invisibility with sheer, devastating performance. Stealth is often misunderstood as complete invisibility, but in reality, it is a complex art of deception. The F-22 doesn't vanish into thin air, it manipulates how radar and infrared sensors perceive it. The jet's diamond-shaped airframe, internal weapon bays, and serrated edges are all designed to scatter radar waves away from their source. Its radar cross-section is estimated to be as small as 0.0001 square meters, roughly equivalent to a bumblebee. Radar-absorbent materials, RAM, coat its surface, absorbing electromagnetic energy rather than reflecting it. But stealth goes beyond radar evasion. The Raptor's engines are buried deep within its fuselage, and the exhausts are flattened to minimize its infrared signature, the heat that sensors use to track aircraft. Even the cockpit canopy is coated with a thin layer of gold to block radar reflections from the pilot's helmet. Every single design choice, from the angle of the tail fins to the way panels are joined, is a product of stealth philosophy. The result is not an aircraft that hides, but one that deceives. It doesn't need to disappear entirely, it simply ensures the enemy sees it too late. In an age when detection means death, that split-second advantage makes the F-22 not just invisible, but invincible. If stealth is the Raptor's shield, thrust vectoring is its sword. This technology allows the aircraft to do things that seem to defy the very laws of aerodynamics. Unlike traditional jets that rely solely on control surfaces, like flaps and rudders, the F-22's engines themselves move. Each nozzle can pivot up to 20 degrees, directing the thrust and allowing the jet to turn, roll, and climb in ways that no human pilot should logically survive. The result is breathtaking agility, the F-22 can perform maneuvers like the Cobra, the J-turn, and tight post-stall rolls that leave even seasoned pilots speechless. In a dogfight, that means the Raptor can outmaneuver almost anything, even missiles. This technology, combined with its ability to supercruise, flying at supersonic speeds without afterburners, gives it a deadly combination of speed and control. While other fighters struggle to sustain Mach 1 without draining fuel, the F-22 can cruise comfortably above it, arriving first and striking first. For adversaries, facing an F-22 is like fighting an opponent who moves faster, sees further, and reacts before you do. 
It's not a fair fight, and it was never meant to be. Inside the F-22's cockpit lies one of the most sophisticated digital ecosystems ever built into a fighter jet. Its an slash APG-77 radar is an active electronically scanned array, ASA, system that can track multiple targets at extreme range, some say over 200 kilometers, all while remaining almost undetectable itself. The radar can even perform electronic attacks, jamming or confusing enemy systems before they ever detect a threat. But what truly makes the F-22 deadly is its sensor fusion technology. Data from radar, infrared, and electronic sensors are combined into a single interface, giving the pilot complete situational awareness. In combat, the pilot sees the entire battle space, friendlies, hostiles, and even ground threats all updated in real time. This allows the Raptor to engage enemies beyond visual range with missiles like the AIM-120D AMROM, or close in for a kill using the AIM-9X Sidewinder. To the pilot, it feels less like flying a machine and more like commanding an extension of their own mind. Every decision is instantaneous, every move precise. It's this combination of artificial intelligence, speed, and stealth that makes the F-22 not just a weapon, but an apex predator in the digital age of warfare. Despite being nearly two decades old, the F-22 still stands unrivaled. Its design is so advanced that the United States refuses to export it, even to its closest allies like Japan or the United Kingdom. This exclusivity has only added to its mystique. While the world's other superpowers, Russia with its Su-57 Felon and China with its J-20 Mighty Dragon, strive to replicate the Raptor's capabilities, none have succeeded. The F-22's stealth coatings, electronic warfare systems, and thrust vectoring control remain unmatched. Even its weaknesses are few, maintenance complexity and high costs are often cited, but in exchange, the aircraft provides a dominance that money can't measure. The US Air Force has invested heavily in keeping it updated, adding new radar software, improved weapons, and communication systems that link it with fifth-generation allies like the F-35. For many, the F-22 represents the peak of human engineering, a weapon so perfect that it ended its own competition. No nation dares to challenge it directly in open skies. To this day, no F-22 has ever been shot down in combat. It remains undefeated, untouchable, and feared across every horizon. As the world steps into a new era of air warfare, the question arises, can anything ever surpass the F-22 Raptor? The U.S. is already developing its next-generation air dominance, NGAD, fighter, a sixth-generation aircraft that promises AI-assisted flight, adaptive engines, and drone coordination. Yet, even as technology marches forward, the F-22 continues to reign supreme. Its combination of stealth, thrust vectoring, and combat intelligence remains unmatched. But perhaps its greatest weapon isn't its radar cross-section or missile range, it's the fear it commands. The knowledge that somewhere above, unseen and unheard, an F-22 could be watching. To adversaries, that thought alone changes how wars are fought. The Raptor doesn't just dominate battles, it shapes them before they begin. It embodies the philosophy that true power is not in being seen, but in being untouchable. So, will the F-22 Raptor remain the undisputed ruler of the skies, or will a new generation finally dethrone the invisible king? Tell us what you think in the comments below, because in the silent world of stealth warfare, the question of who controls the sky is never truly settled.